Alright, hello guys, today we're going to be bringing you my forecast for Winter Storm Scott, but before I get started with the video, I would ask that you do subscribe for content like this. I also do weekly videos, monthly forecasts, seasonal forecasts, and other forecasts for storms like this in general. So please subscribe if you do uh, consider that information to be useful. Uh, a lot of people do. Now, we're going to be looking at our snowfall map, and that's all we're going to be looking at in this video. This could really have a lot of bust potential, meaning that this could really go down uh, very fast, uh, or this could turn out to be uh, really good. So you're going to need to stay tuned. I'm going to keep you guys all updated on the forecast for this storm as this could change a lot very quickly as of right now I have a one to three section basically taking over the entire map here at least getting a dusting to three inches now we do have that three to six inch amount area in the lightest shade of blue that extends from portions of Ohio West Virginia Northern Virginia portions of Maryland southeastern Pennsylvania northern New Jersey New York City southern Connecticut southern Rhode Island Cape Cod Massachusetts northern Maine extreme northern New Hampshire and northern Vermont as well as a lot of the upstate portions of New York now we do have a 6 to 10 inch amount and that's going to be your kind of medium shade of blue in there and that extends from the areas of very far eastern uh, West Virginia very far western uh, Maryland we have central portions of Pennsylvania up through the extreme northeastern or northwestern sorry portions of New Jersey southern upstate New York northern Connecticut northern Rhode Island all of Massachusetts almost uh, portions of southern Vermont as well as portions of southern uh, New Hampshire or central New Hampshire as well as central Maine now we do have this darkest shade of blue or almost a black looking color this is where we're expecting 10 to 15 inches of snow uh, that extends from northeastern Pennsylvania there's a little section there and then we have an, a section that takes over a lot of Massachusetts extreme northern Connecticut extreme northern Rhode Island southern New Hampshire and coastal regions of Maine then we have our 15 inch plus region in the purple this could really be taken away or really we could stick with it or enhance or grow that area I don't really know at this point but that's gonna take over Boston north into a lot of Massachusetts there southern New Hampshire coastal New Hampshire and a lot of the coastal regions of Maine anyway I hope you guys enjoyed this video please stay tuned for the latest updates as this looks to be one that I might need to update uh, significantly here in the future anyway guys I hope you enjoyed the video I hope to see you in the next one